There is so much expertise and information to my left. With that being said, we can only get to so much. So if you have an interest in maybe it's very personal and you want to talk, you have questions, you can do that with Elder Advisors, a free workshop. The information is absolutely free and it will save you money. Larry, let's talk about your next workshop. Yep. Uh, next Monday and Tuesday, we're doing 10 a.m. again for Kentucky. It seemed to work out uh, the past several months. So Monday is at the Hilton Garden Inn uh, on Crittenden Drive, right off exit 132 at 10 a.m. And then, of course, for the Hoosiers, Indiana, Tuesday, 10 a.m. at the Hilton Garden Inn on Broadway, right off Veterans Parkway. Uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. Uh, they can go to freeworkshop.com, or of course they can call 855-LARRY-55 because all of your questions will be answered. Quite frankly, a lot of your problems in life will be solved by calling 855-LARRY-55. <laughs> well, we laugh about that, but this is something everyone's going to have to face at one point or another. So I think the reason why we are apprehensive and put it on the back burner, I understand, because it's like you think it's bad news, but Steve always says that Steve Langer the attorney, Steve Langdon always says, it's good news. It is good news. And I to mean, Steve's credit, it is good news because, uh, you know, we met with a family this morning and, you know, if Kentuckian hasn't figured out, you know, I'm a little bit of a card. I like having fun. Look, you know, I'm living. I'm not existing. I love what I do. I get up every morning. I'm surrounded by top talent. And certainly there's no better example of that than what with me today to my left with Lindsay and Autumn. These ladies are angels. They know what they're doing. And I don't have to look over their shoulder. They do what they do. I do what I do. You know, they're not calling with simple questions. They know what to do. They're empowered to do what they need to do because it is a team approach to protect assets. So you don't go broken nursing home. Larry always says that he wants to surround himself with the very best talent. And Autumn, you referred to what Lindsay did and what she brings to the table. So Lindsay, you've talked to me a little bit about this. Tell them why Larry had his eyeball on you and I want to hire her. You're now a senior VP. So t tell me well, exactly I, what you do. I think it had a lot to do with my husband, um, is the reason why I was initially hired here. But, you know, he's a lumberjack <laughs> up he's in Canada. Lumberjack, really. Outside of Larry's love right. affair with my husband. Um, I see him at the grocery store on the cover of Bounty. Right? 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 I'm a two-time and man, baby. That's how it started. Um, but no, and I think, and again, what I've really enjoyed seeing is the passion that Steve and Larry and Autumn, that the whole entire team brings to serving their clients. And, and they're, it's complicated. Nursing facility language, when we talk about PRN and falls risk and nom nox, and it's a language, right? It's an entire You're language. You're very familiar. Yeah. Of, and, and Larry just didn't speak that language. And that's fine. That's totally fine. And Autumn, even on the placement part of it, well, their place, that's fantastic. Then what happens at the quarterly care plans that are required or when state surveys in the building and these things? Because I lived it for 15 years, I'm able to bring a perspective for both families to understand um, and also ways to communicate and facilitate great communication back and forth between the families and the facilities that our clients are placed at. And, so. and for you, Autumn, because you have such contacts, you've been doing this for yeah. a long time. I'm Sometimes uh, someone like me, I may call and they're, no, can't help you, whatever. You know who to yeah. get to to get things done. Yeah, so we, we know a lot of the business office managers, uh, the admissions office, just just a lot of different people in the nursing home world that maybe other people wouldn't think to ask for. But they, they most of the time just don't know the right the right questions, the right things to say. We want to talk about financials, but we want to do it in a certain way, a certain manner. Um, so I really think it's beneficial just to come in and see, you know, what what we can bring to the table to help them with, whether it just be placement, a little bit of conversation on their behalf so that they don't freak out in the, in the nursing home. Because they call and they're like, they said oh, all this money, and I'm like, just take a breath. Let me make the phone call. I'll straighten it out for you. Just sit tight for, you know, you probably it's, don't have to worry about it for a week or two. But and let it's me barbershop law on that part, yeah. too, right? Mm -hmm. So in the financial world, but also right. what happens, and, and, and Autumn has... Autumn has like the contact, like you know what I mean. The, well, the so does Lindsay, and I'm learning more from her too because she has been in the world longer best. than me. So. We don't, we don't <laughs> Google ABC Nursing Home. Right. You know, Autumn picks up her phone and she's got the cell phone number of the decision maker because we've worked with them before. They know our clients. They know we're going to fulfill what we've said that we're going to do for the families, um, and and they enjoy working with us. These facilities enjoy working with us because um, we we can clearly navigate the way for these families and it's it's a real tool for Kentucky Anna. and you know here's a real subtle way of how we do business and this is a, a shout out for Autumn big time was I think it was uh, Mr. Jerry yesterday right Autumn Jerry mm -hmm. and when he was here a couple weeks ago he made a point of saying how he enjoyed getting a little appointment card from Autumn because yep. she put a little smiley on it. <laughs> 
and you yeah. know, he I wrote him one in person. He said, "Well, there's no smiley on it." Right. Oh. So right. I he was, I thought, I mean, we well, all strive for that smiley right. when we're in school. Yeah. I want that smile. Right. It's a little bit of these, personal effect. These Very nice. Need that care. I mean, at the most. No yeah, one does that. At, at the hardest <laughs> no time, truly, in their for lives, you. Um, you know, our families deserve and get this type of care. It's what they deserve. There, there's so much knowledge here, so I cannot overemphasize the importance of attending the workshop. Yeah. Larry, there's so many different layers. Yep. You know, we, you, you mentioned real estate. We went right over some of these things, yep. but there's a lot of different components here that go into this. Well, and when we do the workshop, you know, we start with th three key questions I ask the attendees, and I tell them, you don't have to be honest with me, but you need to be honest with yourself. So the first question is, how many friends or, uh, how many people have friends or family in a nursing home now or about to go to nursing home? Hands will go up. That's nine, ten thousand dollars. That's crisis planning. We can help. If it's a husband and wife, as I said earlier, we can keep all the assets. If it's a single person, about half. Then the second question is more of a pre-crisis planning. How many people have someone that's at home? We're getting some rehab. Maybe we're having someone check in every couple hours on mom, hoping physical therapy will work. Hands will go up. That's pre-crisis planning. We can help as well. And the third variable is pre-planning. How many people simply want to avoid this and get out from under? All the remaining hands go up. Those are the three spectrums that we deal with at the workshop. We can help all those people. That's what the workshop's about. Come out. Mr. Langdon will be there sharing the good news of the legal comp component. We do the financial part so you don't go broke in the nursing home. And we make ourselves available for fr free private consultations to get into the days in our lives nuances of the soap opera dynamics. Very well done. Yes. Well, it's a lead-in for 1 o'clock today. That's what I was going to say. That's showbiz language. You'll get soon. there someday, John. I appreciate that. I'm, I'm learning every day from you. <laughs> okay. Autumn, for you, you know, this. what I love about this dynamic here, it's real. Yeah. You guys know you're helping people. The work has to be yeah. rewarding. So for those who maybe are saying, okay, you know, I, I don't believe it. I know I'm going to have to go through all this money. Are you ever amazed about your clients and how much money that you can save? That? And are they amazed? Yeah. What kind of reaction do you get yeah, from them? Yeah. So I mean, just taking it back to, you know, my first couple of weeks at Elder Advisors, which was almost five years ago, I mean, it felt so good. I would go home and think, wow, we're helping so many people. We're helping so many people. I didn't know that this was a thing. I didn't know. I didn't understand the trust. I didn't understand the, the nursing home part of it. And to see, you know, that we can save everything for a married couple. I mean, and to see their faces, I mean, they cry of That's happiness. So yeah. and, and, I mean, you just feel good. You just get to take a lot you know, of good with pride me at the end of the day, every day. Pride in your work, yeah. Yeah, yeah pride in your work, a reward. Very nice. Okay, with 30 seconds remaining, Larry, I'm going to let you, if you would, invite them to the workshop because Kentucky, this is good and it's fun. Kentucky, and it it's fun. fun. It's usually it's at the, the attorney's party. expense, Steve Langdon. It's good news. It's at Steve's expense, but he's a great attorney. He's the elder law superstar attorney. He'll be there Monday, 10 a.m. at the Hilton Garden Inn off Crittenden Drive. Go to freeworkshop.com for details. Tuesday morning, 10 a.m. at the Hampton Inn on Broadway, freeworkshop.com in Indiana, or you can always call. 855 Larry 55 for all of your questions and answers. We get them taken care of. Had a good time with you guys once again, Larry. Thank you so much. Always good to see you. And you are much better dressed than I am. Uh, Lindsay, thank you very thank much. You. Hi, Bailey. Happy Autumn. birthday. Thank Always you, Autumn. Thank you. Good to see you. Yep. And happy birthday to Bailey, obviously. All right. We'll take a little break here. And then coming up, Myron Sari will be here.